morning, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for tuning in one more time to TV3's Community Manifesto. And this morning, we are coming to you from Peki Avetile, specifically the Anivi Market. And we are in the South Dying constituency. South Dying, are you here? Yeah. South Dying, are you here? Yeah. A round of applause for all of you. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. We are here for the community. It's not just an NDC or MPP rally, but if you're also representing any of the political parties, please make yourself known so we can acknowledge you. But before we start, let's give respect to whom respect is due. Mama Milo. All the leaders of the community have gathered with us this morning. And before we get into proceedings, if there's anything that anybody wants to say, we want to give you precedence first. That anything that anybody wants to say, be it contribution, a low question, will start from you. Is that fine? Thank you so very much. Well, I'll take my seat right now and give you a little background of this constituency that we have found ourselves this morning. This, again, I've already stated, is South Daim. And formerly, it was part of a larger group, the Kwando district. But I remember that before the 2004 elections, ex-president J.O. Kufour decreed that it be made a smaller constituency. So from 2004, it became the South Dai constituency. The NPP, however, has struggled in this constituency as it has largely been the stronghold of the NDC. Now, as we speak, as we speak, Honorable Roxin, Nelson, Kwame, Dafiamakbo is the sitting MP of this constituency and he's sitting to my left, but I'll give him the opportunity to introduce himself later. But also on the MPP side, even though they have suffered a little bit in this constituency, they are looking to change the narrative come election 2024. And this morning, they are being represented by their parliamentary candidate, who is also the DCE of the area. His name, Godwin Kwame Dajawa. And I'll give him the opportunity to introduce himself first because he's incoming and then of course we give the sitting MP the opportunity to give us his opening remarks even before we start discussions this morning. Gentlemen, you're welcome. Sir, we'll start with you. Is it working? Take this first. Take this first. It's supposed to work but you can take mine. Uh, thank you. Before I introduce myself, I would like, I would like to greet the good people of South Dine for the massive support I am receiving from you and continue to receive from you. We are specifically in Avetili, Peki. So I would like to acknowledge our paramount chief, the Gang Koju De, the 12th, Togbe Ayim, Modi the 6th, and all the chiefs and queen mothers okay. present here. Uh, as you know, I'm your own brother. I am called Godwin Kwame Dajawa. Okay, let's make it brief. Let's make it brief. But politically, I name myself and love to be called King Jaja. All right. The, 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 the only king in Ghana politics as well as Subdine. All right. I've unveiled myself. As a result of the call from the good people of South Dine to contest 
on the ticket of MPP this year. And by God, by God grace, and said, my good brother, the MP, Honorable Roxine in the chair that Pierre McPaul, who has actually filled the good people of Sabda. All right, we are not there yet. We are not there yet. Sir, so, just introduce yourself so, so we can move on. I am here with my team. Great. My supporters. And with God's grace, I know, inshallah, Amen. we shall surely unseat him All right. and break the eight. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Incumbent MP. Honorable Dapia Makbo, please introduce yourself. Yo, uh, ma Azamonu Papo, Ma Dog Bene, the Gang Kojo de Rivelia, A Dog Bene, Togbe Ayi Modi, A Vetili Fia Gang, Pli, Onyonu Fia Opete, Alabe, Ma Azamonu Papo, Ma Dog Bene, Micho Savdain, Be Milenu Pocho, Anivi Simela Vetili, Alabe, Chole, Sahwe, Ajebui number one, number two, Koi Alaji. Koi Bokope, Koi Bongboni Kope, Koi Jakiti, Germany, Agodake, Atokloko, Abajikpe, Chanakpe, To, Dugan, Ahon, Anglaton, Kaira, Abui, number one, number two, Solomon Kope, Chita, Ticha Kope, Benito Kope, Mi de Chate, Mi Golovime, Nami de Pai Bome, Mi Palatonu, Mi Akpato, me to do me, me soji kope, me blok kope, me anaglate kope, me fubaji, me chopo kope, me peve, me vegbe, me de, me de camp, wawasi, me de chinu, me sanga, na me de anyensu, na me va jake, na me va vetile, na me va afebiofe, na me chame, na me blengo, jobati, wudome, agbate, Namide Ajokwa. Honorable. Namide finally. 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 Honorable. Namide Agon. Honorable. Kajakpa. Blinjinibu. Medakpa Nami Bete. Nyawezo. Ayo. Honorable. So this was only your introduction. That is so. This was only your introduction. You gave the man opportunity and to introduce. all these places introduce. that you have mentioned, yes. you know there. Yes. You have been there. Yes. You have been there. I know. Ah, why do you think I mentioned their name? All right. Yes. Mama I am I am the elected representative Mama in Parliament. Mama Okleto Gbe Ocha Olefi. Mama Okleto Gbe Olefi. Now, as at 2021, the population of this area was somewhere around 57,000. But we can imagine that in 2024, it even is more. Predominantly, the people in this constituency are farmers. They are into a great, they are into fishing and livestock farming and all of that. There are, however, some significant challenges in this constituency, number one being youth unemployment. And because there is no vibrancy in the economy in this area, they tend to migrate into the urban areas. These are some of the issues that we want to tackle this morning. Well, Honorable, the incumbent is going to tell us what he's been able to do in the last eight years or four years that he's been the MP for this area. And the incoming is also going to tell us, because it is his government that is sitting currently, they are also going to tell us what they've been able to do. But before we get to all of that, the community leaders are here. Mama Okule Togbio, Mede Kukunami. In the tututu dele, Midibe Miachinami in Dikeha, in terms of development, whatever, the roads, water, sanitation, in the lay you want to address this morning, ha. Nendele, Merekuku, our ears are on the ground. We want to listen. Merekuku Nami. Hello. Talk to you, Mama. Me de kuku me do tolo. Me de kuku na me. My name is Mama Ayim Cherebia.
the first. Okay. Adonti Hima of Peki traditional area. Right. And then the queen mother of Peki Avitile. You know, I would have liked to speak in English, hmm. but because of my people, I would like to speak ever. Please go ahead. Enye di jona muntobe, egbe enye le, ova be wabati obo manifesto nemi. Dake enye agbanto, e dome le mi agbo, mi avio, o le fukpe, e ke gede bazukbe vue, le gbome, Yatai, and yeah, much no, no, you know, did do. Vemianu na NGOs we no vaban or did do one ado that any abolefi. Neno jagba, no crater, sinu do wo wo, nemi avue. Evelia, mia fe moe. Oh, le jikpem. Ye mada mereke le mo. Wa me vi o pete o lo bo to sun wo. E ke nye ke le. Wa me vi e gbo le me nye na yi nya mi to o. Ka ke. Ma de kuku ne we. O me ga ngolo mi bo. Mi apo palace. Me nyo ko wo. No yi de. Me de kuku ne we. No badger, I don't know me. Oh, my poor new lefi, I blame you. Me, I vote in over. Oh, bad off me, one on me bow. Made the cuckoo nowhere. And ya pay, let off with us here. Blame me up for Cody. No, let Nessie so do daddy. No, do I make me tell he have passion for the patients. Most of them don't have it. Yata maternal mortality, uh, mortality. mortality is going on, on and on. Current one, hey, join. And you know, we did a new video. Oh, that's Which is really bad. Because Ness is only competent. Oh. Yes, only attending to. They must be competent. But they are not doing their job. Negligence. Yes. Okay. And yen told me bubro fi next midwife menu. Me wod off be gede. A favor retirement. That I'm a de kuku nemi. And ya kwe let all as ye. Nemi e de. Ya lem kudem. All right. Especially youth. Obo do. Okay. Shall we give our queen mother a round of applause? In summary. Our Queen Mother is very concerned about unemployment in the community. And she's very worried that because there are no jobs in the community, especially the youth, are going wayward and are gradually becoming social misfits, if we can put it that way. There's a lot of irresponsibility going on because the youth here do not have jobs. So she's pleading that whoever wins the election in 2024 better make sure that you can bring employment into the constituency so that the youth can also have jobs to do. She also mentioned the conditions in the Chief's Palace. It's nothing to write home about. She's asking and advocating that if something could be done about it, she would be more than grateful. Lastly, she's also bitterly complaining about medical negligence in the constituency. Unfortunately, a mother who birthed two babies, twins, actually passed away. Is that correct? She passed away because of medical negligence. And it looks as if the nurses in the constituency are not really paying attention to the profession. She bled to death, okay, because of negligence. It looks like the nurses are not paying attention to exactly what they are supposed to be doing in our clinics and the hospitals and chips compounds in the constituency. And she's asking if that could stop immediately, it would help save the lives of mothers and children in the constituency. Let's come back to the community leaders, please. Any chief, any queen mother, any community leader wants to ask a question, give us a submission or anything. Otherwise, we can move on to the community members. Mara Kukure, 
Mama kule tobu yomi wovo a. Mareku mo wovo. Mareku yo. Mareku unko nyenye tobu ani Andrelia cho avetili amu hulo mele mele. Nyonya nye nyonya nye be mi avio le skude mi ape jilawe wo wo meme la morosi o wo wo me la morosi na ye be mi avido ho do he le skula o pass ka ke ji popo la le fude ta ma bia cho si be ho yi de mere kuku newe oni na scholarship we le wo ho la mo na le tepe tepe we de ni fe mi awo mi afia we chi de mi atan cho ayi de school me ala me de vida si akule ko yi eke scholarship na odo ka kele mi ape malo pekinu to me le fila o me le mi afia o bude na de ke me o le school o me ne ye be mi de hospital abele ke mama o gbele chi si gboku onye ta ma de kuku ne mi ne be mi yi mi na mi avio ni po do pe la pe do pe de ke me le o hospital Bila sku ye to ome kho ome nya kho ne nya ba le gbe pu alo zu watch ma alo nya le nu dane sku vi we we e to re ke me ga le gbo mo ayi gba lo mi asi mere ko ni na do fo de oni fe mi agbo mi a chi mi po do de ne mi a jide ni je mi a do me be nu e ke mi a ton wo de ne mi wo me du ta ko de mi a no yi de a ba no do all right Okay, thank you very much. Let me just paraphrase, paraphrase that quickly. He's also concerned about unemployment and especially also wants to touch on education. He says that in other constituencies, the MCEs, DCEs, or even the MPs are able to garner scholarships for all the students or some of the students in the constituencies. But unfortunately, it does not happen in South Dai. So he's pleading that whoever wins in 2024, please make sure that you are able to at least sponsor a few of the students in this area onto higher education. Thank you very much for that one. Um, shall we now... Okay, please, a round of applause for all our community leaders. Thank you very much. Shall we now come to the community members? Sir, are you the first to speak? Do you want to speak first? Okay, your name. Thank you. My name is Apenten Ransford. Okay. I am known as Amiki. Thank you, my host. Honorable Godwin Kwame Dajawa, God richly bless you. God richly bless you. You have been selected to lead South Dai. And I know that the God we worship will take you there. Okay. God bless you. All right. I thought you had a question or a comment. Are there any issues in the community that you want to address? Eh? Thank you, my host. If not, Honorable God require that Jawa, I wouldn't know that we had had any DCs before to talk of even MPs. Honorable Kwame Dajawa, since you assume office within these three years, what you have done is unprecedented. 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 If I have not said that, will you laugh? If I have not said that, will you laugh? Okay. It's unprecedented. Shall we get to the core of the matters? What yes. has he done that you want to talk about? Yes. Honorable Dajawa, a.k.a. King Jaja, has not been discriminating. He has been the hub of development in the whole constituency. Okay. He has done his best in terms of providing roads, providing water, Bringing agenda 11191, pro completing the Eastern Corridor Road. Sir? Sir? Yes, dear. Sir? Yes, dear. Did you say he has brought or completed agenda 111? He brought and he is on it. Agenda 111 on. is almost 90% completed. Okay. Agenda 111 is almost 90 percent completed. Okay. He ensured he ensured that the 40 kilometers road, that is the Eastern Corridor Road from Ajakwe to Perfect Stretch, Hello. is completed. 
I just want to correct you moving forward. Agenda 111 is a mother flagship program of the NPP. Yes. It's either supposed to be a district hospital or a regional hospital. Yes. So I am asking, is it a district hospital that he has brought and completed? Is that what you're saying? I just need us to get the facts correct. It is correct. the Agenda 111. Everybody in Ghana knows what is Agenda 111. And one, I am one. saying yes. that since this is South Dai It is the district hospital. It is, which is complete. Almost 90% completed right. by the guy courtesy of Honorable Godwin. We, we, will get we will get there. Fantastic. We'll get there. I thought you had a question. But it's not a question you have, right? It's not a question. Okay, because but on the achievement of mm -hmm. this noble man, mm -hmm. the he's people's here choice. To, he's here to speak for himself. The so people's choice. When it is his turn, he will do the talking. When he needs help, I'm sure he'll come to you for the help. When it is that but time. But before we get to before we get to the campaign and achievements, we just want to pick a few of the challenges in the constituency. When it is that time, please draw my attention I will. so I that will. I can talk. Fabulous. Thank you very much. Anybody with any challenge? Challenges, yes, sir. Let's hear from you. Yeah, um, I am Emmanuel Kwami Denu. Please be quiet. Mada Kukuna Milo, Maga Jagomolo, Maga Jagomolo, Nemi Jagomokomi Akpa. Okay, let's hear you, sir. Yeah. Um, thank you very much. I am Emmanuel Kwami Denu. And then before I ask my question, I would like to establish a premise to the question. Now, uh, TV3, in the first place, we want you to know that the upcoming election is not election between the NDC and then the NPP. It is an election between Godwin Kwame Dajawa and Dapia Mekpo. And this is the first time the people are united because of what they are going through. For the past eight years, the leader of this constituency does not attend to the people. He always pays deaf ear to the needs of the people. There is underdevelopment, no development under the leadership of uh, Dapia Mekwa. All he does is to move about deceiving the people. His political philosophy is machi avellianism, where he uses manipulation deception, lies, and that is all he does. When we have projects done by the central government and the district assembly, the people will be moving about saying that he is the one that lobbied for the projects. I want to ask him this morning, I want to ask him this morning that for the past eight years, what we have gone through, he hasn't done anything. Why should we, the people okay. of South Dine, send him to parliament again? We said no. Sir, we said no. Sir, and he will not go. You've been going on and on about what you have gone through. Can you list three of some of the things that you've gone through? Just three, please. Thank you very much. In the first place, his absence. In the constituency. In the second place. In the second place, he hasn't brought any development into Safdan. In the last does, eight years? In the last eight years. No development? No development. And the third one is which one? And the third one, on that, all he does is to go about with deception. Manip in fact, his focus is just to win election and nothing more. He doesn't care about the people of Safdan. And it is time we are unified to move stuff that forward and we are all removing right. him okay thank you honorable is noting all the things that you are saying and in due course i'm sure he will respond appropriately good morning sir let's get to meet you good morning uh, my name is elvis uh well i have few concerns okay and at the end i'll ask both candidates right a question please go ahead uh, first and foremost i want to acknowledge that indeed uh, we cannot say Honorable Dapia Mekwa has done massively well. Okay. But, but he has done his bit through his common fund. He has done his bit mainly because this is an orphan constituency. His government is not in power. 
Can we get to the core of the issues, yes. sir? So, so. If, if. Please go ahead. Mainly because of that. But I know personally certain projects he has lobbied for and they have been done. Okay. And with all indications right now, mm. uh, it is certain or s almost certain that President Mahama is winning. So we cannot elect an opposition MP to lead us again. So that, so that we will be often seat again. Right now, if he wins and President Mahama wins, we can demand or stand on him for all the developments that we require in this community. What three things do you need as a youth in this community? Yes, the three things I need as a youth in this community. First of all, mm. youth unemployment is very rampant okay. and is rendering the youth somehow useless. Yeah. So I will appeal to whoever wins mm. that some kind of job creation if a factory can be created mm. that can employ mm. the youth. Secondly, we can do mass farming by providing tractors and farm equipment. Mm. This can help people to farm. Okay. Because this is a farming community. Right. So we have to do that and subsidize agricultural inputs so that farmers can farm and get some profit on their farm. Planting for food and jobs. Uh, well, I haven't gotten any information about that here. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so There's been no activity regarding planting for food all. and jobs? Not no at activity all. whatsoever? Not at all. Okay. Not at all. Not okay. at all. You and haven't benefited from that intervention? Not at all. Okay. Not Let's at move all. on. Yes. Lastly, what would you need? Yes. So, lastly, our roads. Uh, as Avetile Township, we have initiated some self-help programs. Okay. So we would want him to help in constructing the Southern Town Roads. Mm. They are very, very, very important to us. Mm. So these are the three things you need I'll, as a youth. Yes, but I have a question for both of them. Okay. Yes. Uh, first to our uh, PC. For MPP? The, yes, for MPP. Uh, we heard that uh, there's an astroturf being constructed. <laughs> Honorable Dafia Mekpo came to IAM Festival about three days ago mm. and said he lobbied for it. But now we are hearing that that is not the case. Okay, so you want clarification? Yes, we are hearing that he said the one that is being done mm. is not what. Uh, MP has lobbied, lobbied for. for. So I want clarification on that. From Honorable okay. uh, Dapia, uh, sorry, Jaja. Okay. That is, I want that clarification okay. from him. And I finally, I want our uh, uh, city MP hmm. to take this district or constituency very, very careful. Hmm. Or He's, he has to be very, very active here. So you feel he's not involved in the constituency? We need him more. You're not feeling him. Yes, we need him more. You're not more. feeling his presence. Yes. When he has won and President Mahama has won, mm. we know that resources will be available to okay. him and we don't want to be deprived again okay. in this constituency. All right. Thank you so much. Okay. All right. I think it's time. I'll give you the opportunity, but please take note of your questions. I remember he's asking about the AstroTef, so we'll come to you for a response on that one. And there's another one he says being constructed, and you said you lobbied for it, so please, Honorable, keep that in mind. Yes, sweetheart, your name, please. Irene Bali. Okay, Irene. Okay, Irene. Edomo, soja alo polis o sika miya be MP te gola na be ikola mo oko ye. Me di ma biya MP be amene no kolo ko ye. Okay. Okay. Me di ma ka biya be. Mareku hold on lo, hold on, hold on. The first of all, security services e. You ti be ya biya be amene ne. Amene ne miya be MP for eight good years. Uh huh. Kolo But did he did he promise that? Is that what he promised? I gola be ikola mo oko ye. Okay. 
All right, sir, please close that down. Okay. Is there another question? Common fund for the past eight years. Look at Common fund. 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 Common Aha. Uh -huh. Mara kwa tefuto wala nyo walas. Macho Germany. Madwe ma bia ba bia efe eh, King Jaja. Banto enye ba aika efe jududu fu akoso bo dama. Wele mi adem le Germany afoka ode to enguna mi. Yika mi apa MP le wuliti butme fiani ndo eza le chachakulimi nuka o ase eh, eh, ase dizi to enguna mi. Efele anya ba Efele anya ba Madibe ma bie bere Mi afe MP Ekle Sabda en duko kata fifi lai Madibe ma bie jaja wa bere Enya e duade ka wo yobe tongo Ato klopo ha Le wo nye de Nu kanye nu o wale fi ma pon ha Akpe nami Alright Jaja Let's come to you. Yes. Okay, one more on this side, and then we'll take the responses. I've taken a lot of questions from here, so let me take one more from here. One more from here. The microphone, guys. One more from here. One more from here. Hello? Yeah, thank you very much. I'm David Livingston Agbobada, a member of Germany, Germany community. Okay. Thank you very much. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm, I'm a concerned youth from Germany community. Thank you very much. Okay, I would like to ask our DC some very important questions. Go ahead. Thank you. Some of our people here do mention some few things, and I would like him to clarify certain things on that. First of all, the district common fund. The district common fund. That has been asked already. Yes. So move I'm, to your I'm next coming, question I'm to help us. I'm coming to ask a follow-up question. Okay. Good. We know very well. If they don't know, I want to let them understand today. Mm. The main developmental agent in a constituency is the DC. It is. Ask them, are they aware? That is the reason why, or oh, I can say with more evidence, that that is the reason why the district common fund, 95% goes to the DC, and the 5% 5, 5 goes to the MP. Go ahead with your question. I want question. them to understand this. Go ahead Time with more. your question, please. You. As he has become our DC for the past four years now, what has he used that district combo fund to do for us? Okay. Especially the people of Germany. Okay. We would like to know that. Coming to talk of our revenue that they collect from Germany market. The major market that produces revenue for this district is Germany. Okay. Yet our market is deteriorating and they are not doing anything about it. Our market not lack a whole vital amenities such as let's say urina. We don't have you now. We have poor lightning system. We have poor security system. There's no urinal at all at in the all, market. There is no not even urinal. one. There is no not even urinal. one. No not even one. In Germany. What is he using the money, the revenue he's taking from all us right. to do? Okay. Madam, please, I'm not done. Okay. I have very important questions. Please for you. go ahead. When we come to the premise, 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 the oil that do come to Germany. Germany is known for its market values. Okay. And we know them. The reason why our market has value is because of what? the urban motors that they are using. Mm. That is the boats and then the fisheries. Okay. Yet, right now as I speak to you, our market, especially the fishing aspect, has deteriorated. What is he doing about it at the DC? And coming to talk about the premise, as he has become the uh, DC right now, as we speak, we have never seen any premise in Germany, but yet he is diverting most of the, uh, the, the premises to uh, 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 non fashioning communities. Do you have evidence? Yes, please. You've got evidence. Like do Dodi, like Dodi. You've got evidence you are saying, oh, that he's diverting. You are not here. You, All right. No, 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 no. Don't incite no, anyone. No. 
Don't incite anyone. Please. A very important one. Again. Your last question, I beg My you. Last one. Your My last, last one. question, yes. Coming to talk of our roads. Coming to talk of our roads. Germany is a leading market community. We have road from Asikuma to Germany and Pever to Germany. There is no doubt that during our market days, people move from diverse communities, even in other regions, to Germany. But yet, we don't have access to proper road. As we speak, as we speak, uh, as we speak, that is why I told you the main developmental agent is the DC. You don't know, so you have to go and learn. You have to go and learn. All right. You don't know what is going on. Yes. Thank you so much for your question. Please. Thank you. Can Sweet I hands. Can I come? Can you, I conclude? You've just had one your minute. time. You've had your time. I'm a heart. I'm a heart practitioner. I have a very important question. So go ahead and yes. don't waste your time. Thank you very much. Please. Our ma queen mother here has just mentioned something concerning medical negligence. Thank you very much. All right. We are asking him as a DC. Mm. Ever since he has become the DC, has he ever? Has he ever organized a free health screening to mobilize blood donation? Okay. Let's say we have blood to convey to the various, the various right. hospitals okay. and clinics okay, no problem. to save life. Okay. I want to ask him about All right. Jaja, so many concerns this morning from AstroTef to medical negligence to sanitation to urinals and even toilets not being available in the Germany market to premix fuel, so many of them. Kindly, kindly, kindly provide your response. Yeah, sir. thank you very much. Uh, I would like to start with the AstroTef. The AstroTef, this is, this is the uh, document, the contract document. The contract document says construction of three AstroTef. We are, we are, we are in a national television, TV3. And this AstroTef, there are three in the region, together with this number three, bedroom, affordable house at Hu, Afajato South, Afajato South and South Dine. All these projects are given to one contractor. Okay. And I'm having AstroTef and three bungalows okay. given to one contractor. Before I answer them, I just want to ask the one who asked this question that has the MP lobbied for all these astrotep in the Volta region? One, one is in Afajato South, another one is at Klepe, which is the regional minister's hometown, and the third one is in my hometown. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a fact that when the president came to 175th anniversary celebration of AP Church in Peke Blangu or at Peke Blangu, he asked that very day, all of you get this clear. I invited Honorable Roxin to that celebration. He was at home, NDC was carrying out a program at home. If he can be very faithful to you people, he will tell you. I invited him. He was not ready to come. And I said he should come. Because at that time, he was very nice with me. When the president came, myself, himself, and the regional minister, we were sitting at the days. And the president, Acts, looking at Chame Park, looking at Chame Park, what can I do on that park for the youth of this community? Before God and man, the MP said, Astrotef will do. He spoke before me. Later on, the president, we are in a national television. The project wasn't coming. The president was in executing the project. So the MP, together with Dr. Lecher, they went to Accra. When they went to Accra, they told him that because he has taken the president to court on El... Be 
because he has taken the president to court, he should go back and do his homework well before he come back. And the MP actually wrote this thing on one of our platforms called Southdown Political Platform. People are here. He stated clearly on that platform that people went and actually spare him. Let me use this word, spare him to the president. That's why he was sacked. So the project cannot come off. Later on, we went to a meeting, a program at Accra. Sir, if you can see I want, up. I want all of you to listen clearly. We went to Accra for a meeting. Honorable Natoshi was there, and they said they were sharing some astrotech. And Volta region is receiving three of that. Dr. Lecha was in the program, was in the meeting. Dean of MDCs in Volta region, called Odnabo Pololo, was in that meeting. I was also in the meeting, that same meeting. Then Dr. Lecher said he will take one to his hometown, Klepe. The, the, MD, the Dean of M MDCs in Volta also said he is our leader, so he will also take one. Then I told Odnabo Natoshi, that your husband is from Peki here. So I'm taking the last one to my hometown, which she agreed. And later on, the contract, the contract has been awarded and three other projects have been added to it, which currently is taking place at who? I am uh, taking place at Pefe. I am executing the staff Bangalore. This residency, three of them at Pepe so you can before, the, before the Astro Tef is also ongoing at Peki Jake. Okay. This is, but the question I wanted to ask if really Honorable Roxin has lobbied for a project, I don't think the one who said he will give him the project to be built at Chame Park will be giving me the project and I will send the project to a different place. And the president will not ask me any question. Okay. He should rather go back to the president, okay. beg the president, kneel down for the president to give him the con the, 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 the youth, the youth or, or the mini stadium right. that he promised the good people of Peki Chame. Okay. He denied them that project. Okay. He should go back to him and beg. We are on national. We are on national television. Jaja. Jaja, King Jaja cannot sit here and tell lies. King Jaja. Because throughout the world, people throughout the globe are hearing are me. King so Jaja. the MP okay. should go back to the president, kneel down before him, beg him okay. for that project to be given to him. Right. Thank you. There have been questions. There have been questions. There have been questions about... Should I give him the opportunity to respond before we go to your other let, questions? Let me, let me because the there was unemployment, there was yes. medical negligence, and then you mentioned something else. Spillage, spillage. The premix fuel. Yeah. Yes. I'll come to the premix fuel. But let me answer the second person who said when there was a spillage of both Bong and Akusumbu Dam, there was a flood situation at Germany, what have I done during the spillage and the flooding situations that they observe at Germany? Very good. I wanted to let my good brother who asked this question to know that Germany is at the upstream of Akosombo Dam. So whenever there is spillage, the volume of water at Germany rather actually subside. So the yes, all all those. Co if you are ignorant, listen to fat. Germany is at the upstream okay. of 
So they don't get affected. Is so that what you're saying? Whenever there is spillage, they don't get affected. Whenever there is spillage, they don't get the affected. The spillage rather help the volume of the lake to subside. But yeah, you can find out, my good sister. Okay. Hot, All right, sir. Hello. What actually caused that flood situation? Jaja, at Germany? Jaja, hold on. We are still in the first hour and we want to be very fair. Yes. You've been speaking for a very long time. You've mentioned a number of things. I want Honorable Dapia Mekpo to also... No, no, no hold on. You, I'm going to come back to you. I'm going to come back to you. But you've been speaking for some time. So I just want to be fair to give him the time to also respond no, to some sister, other issues. Bet, bet, I promise you, I'll come yeah, back bet, to you. Bet, the I question promise. the person asks, mm -hmm. yourself, you know much about the upstream of exactly. Akosombo Dam yes. and the downstream. Mm. We, the people but, of Sabda. But if they were not affected, I'm not sure he'll be asking you the no, question no, no, no. he's asking you. I said mm -hmm. that flood situation was caused by heavy downpour of rain. Not, not as a result not of the Not the dam spillage. spillage. Not at all. Not the dam spillage. Not at all. And it was at the same time, yes, about was, a year ago, yes. heavy downpour yes, in Germany. Of rain. You can find out this is a fact. And it wasn't part of the dam spillage. All the communities. Honorable, all the districts. I think you should come in here. All the districts at the upstream okay. of the dam cannot be affected. We are fact by, checking. We are fact checking ca ca that. Can never be affected by spillage. But the people who live there are here and they are telling I, you that they were affected and they're I asking what you did. I am saying that the flooding wasn't caused. By the spillage. No problem. By the flooding. Let's just say it wasn't caused by the dam spillage, yes. but it was caused by rainfall. Yes. The question still remains. That, that is what no, I I'm wanted just to saying, clarify. The question still remains yes. that what have you been able to do for the yes. people of Germany? Thank you very much. But thank you very much. I live with NADMO and VRA, and we supply them. We supply them items such as. Student mattresses, rises, rises. My my not my not more coordinator is here. The not more coordinator you mean, is here. You mean rice? I supply them rice. with mattresses. I go confused when you say rice. Food item, rice. A uh, rice. Rice. Molly, yeah. molly. I said mattresses. Uh, mattresses. mattresses oh, okay. not rice. Okay. I said mattresses. Okay. I gave them my mattresses. I gave them rice. I gave them a lot of food items and it was my NADMO coordinator who led the team to Germany and beside that beside that Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saint Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saint also called me they called me to come for items to be given to the people but before I reached Accra they said the MP came to them and said he was in Accra so he would take the item to Germany. But when he brought the item, full articulated track of those items, I've not actually set my eyes on them. Wow. Thank you. The MP is here himself. If it's a lie, if you are putting this on him, then he's here to answer for himself. Honorable. Honunami. Uh, I go. The Mediba Madu Gakela, this is Jaja Wak Lakpada Dade, Tamadu Ifube. I go, if I were the president of the republic today, I'll fire this man. He doesn't know his job. Ah, you sit, you sit in South and in Peking and even see me and say that the Astro Turf that is being sponsored by central government wasn't built by the president and that his promise to the people of Peking, he hasn't delivered. Uh, you should be sacked. You are clueless. You don't understand how the work is done. You sit here and say that the president hasn't delivered. Let me educate you. Let me educate you. I, I, I agree that you agree that me and the regional minister followed up. But you lied and said me, I was driven away by the president. President welcomed me. You heard the president say that I am his friend. You all heard it. President welcomed me plus the regional minister in his office and said we, he's grateful that we have come for a follow-up. That the project will be sponsored by 
the district assembly's common fund administrator. Listen, no, listen. And then we should see the chief of staff. You see, you see, this happened in the company of the regional minister, Dr. Lecher, who is your supervisor. So if I'm lying, go and verify. That we went, that we went to see chief of staff. Oh, that chief of staff. Media kuku, media kuku, maga that chief of staff agreed that yes, because there is pressure on GMPC, they will ask Natoshi to fund it. So the astro tell that is being constructed is being funded by the district assembly's common fund. That is the funding source. Now what happened? Why why he went? Why why he? Ebi aku astro tell day. Ya oko tennis court astro tell kone because when ya ebi ata. Go, go to Jacken, Abiabere, Astro Tev, me to Ole. Eh, hold on. Go to Jacken, then Abiabere, Astro Tev, me to Ole. What a football idea. Astro Tev, I never know to let Chame. Yeah, quite quite a dog, woman. So that is about you. But, but, but let me say this. Let me say this. Jaja, Jaja, let me tell you today. You, you will be prosecuted. You, we shall prosecute you. And let me tell you, yes, you'll be prosecuted. I am ready because, for you. Because it's a, yes, we shall prosecute you. Yeah. You are diverting our premise that comes to survive. You are diverting it. With so we evidence, shall prosecute you. I yes, there's rather, evidence. I, so we shall, I, we shall I, prosecute I, you. I will rather take you. Two, two, two. Okay. two. Okay. We shall prosecute you because you are using assembly pickup to do your campaign. So we shall prosecute you. You are using uh, uh, you are using your public office for private gain. We shall prosecute you. This is lie. Dad, it's not a lie. This is lie. The pickup is here. Yes. It's not a lie. Dad, this is not a campaign. Oh, this is not a campaign wait, ground. Wait, wait. Uh, this is we not a campaign you. ground. We shall prosecute you. This is not a campaign ground. Hold on. Ground. Hold on. Number three. Number three. Your constituency executive, who you you told me that we drew money from the premise account. Without lawful authority, you told me I've that never, you told me. I've never. Okay, we when shall prosecute you. You. you told when me. Did I tell so you? that officer, when did I tell that constituency when did I tell you? who withdraw twenty thousand. Yes, you twenty thousand. You gave it to me. I twenty thousand. I'm disappointed in you. you. Know, I am you. disappointed wow. in you. Don't know your work. So, you don't know your work. So, you. So, you. So, so you. Oh, you shall Honorable. be prosecuted. Hold on, Jaja. Let you shall finish. be prosecuted. I'm telling you, you don't know your work. Yes. Now, now, honorable, did you say he had given you twenty thousand? No. What I did am you say? Uh -huh. He uh -huh. told me right that they are one of their constituents. When executives. did I tell you this? Oh, Jaja. When did I tell you? Comport yourself. When? Comport yourself. When did when I you tell were you? Talking, I was quiet. You can't sit here. And I said, tell comport Jaja, yourself. Let him finish. You can't sit here. You, Jaja, you know, I will never you know appear on TV. I can't. You are on TV. I can't. So comport TV. yourself. You are also comport yourself. Jaja, you Jaja, Jaja. Jaja. When you were talking, you. when you were lying, I kept quiet. Comport yourself. When did I tell Please you? go on. Hold on. Can when you go on? You told me Jaja, why you, you got your, your nomination. Jaja, you Let me time. tell you. Why, why you got Jaja, your nomination you your to become DC. When? You told me when? that your constituency executive and that DC Mallet, they went to steal money from premise account. You told me. And then second, Jaja, keep quiet. Keep quiet. Keep quiet. You can't tell me to be, keep quiet. You can't Jaja. tell me to keep quiet. You Jaja. can't tell me to keep quiet. Jaja, you keep quiet. Never. You, you, you are not older than me. You are not older than me. Honorable, these are very serious allegations. Yes. No lie. And me. if investigations are conducted, yeah. and it is not true. Ah, why? You think I'm a small boy? I'm not a small boy. He told you. And, and so you should and keep quiet. Let me add more. So let me add more. Let me add more. Let me add more. Jaja, when you got your nomination, but for me, you wouldn't have become a DC. You were desperate. You told me that some of your constituency executives it's a lie. They wrote a petition. It's oh, a lie. Jaja, can you keep it's quiet? It's a lie. Can you keep quiet? So, are you appoint the appointing authority? No, keep quiet. Are you the one? Keep quiet. You to keep quiet. I'm exposing you. I'm exposing you, so you keep quiet. You can't tell me. I'm exposing you. You are. You sent me the petition they wrote. You brought the petition. Petition. To me. Yes. I guess so do you, you have it. Yes, I have it. You, you prove it. Yes. Prove you it said, they said that you you were causing illegal abortion at Choco when you were a nurse at Kolebu. Oh. You told me that. You I told you that. Yes. I've never you told you anything. 
Don't go with that popular team. And the people who wrote the petition. All right. Can you swear over the petition? Can you swear me the right. copy? Can you swear over the petition you gave me? Can I have a copy? Anna, but you have evidence. Prove it. He gave it to me. I have a copy. The petition. I have a copy. Prove it. I have Anna, a copy. If you have a so lesson, so because you cannot Jaja. put things on and him that he has no And I'm giving you a petition. He has no credibility. This man, Anna, he has no credibility. Now let me school him. You let can't me. school me. Oh, I'll school you. Are we I'm still on the astrotherm? This man, this man, they gave us fertilizer. 400 bucks each. Me, he has taken mine to his house. He hasn't given it to me to me. This man. Who gave you the fertilizer? Ministry of Agric. Ministry of Agric. He's keeping my fertilizer in his house. This man. These are serious ask allegations. Ask him. Ask him. Ask him. Honorable. He's keeping my fertilizer but in if, his house. But if he's taking this it man. to his house, his residence. Is his residence there? Is his residence assembly? His residence is it assembly. Ah, this man. He has no credibility. Ah. Jaja. These allegations I that he's leveling Cookie. against you. Cookie. I'm not done. Yeah, he had. Cookie, Hold on a second. Cookie, I am not done. Two Let me finish. More, please. Yes. Two minutes more. This man, there's a young man from Avetile here. He's called Serpan. Serpan got injured. Because of the things he's saying against me in Avetile, Serpan got injured and approached me for assistance. I wrote to this man. He said Serpan had his respect, so I shouldn't, he won't approve. It took me so long for him to approve this man. When I gave money to Sepp, I said, you won't approve. Ask him. Ask him, how long did it take him to release the money? Ah, Sepp, 100 million Ghana. That's what I approved. Honorable. For his medical bill. So the actual question was about the astroturf. Yes. But it looks like you have gone into the cupboard and brought so many skeletons because, out. Because he has no credibility. He, has, he, he lies. He's an opportunist. When he sees the opportunity, he will lie Honorable. just to get it. Honorable. You understand? Honorable. There was a Hello. question here. I'm going to come to you. Honorable, there was a question here about youth unemployment. Yes. And one of the young ladies who asked the question is asking that you're working about purporting that you have given some of the youth in this constituency an opportunity to serve in our security service or some other security services and they want to know how many people have you been able to enroll in our security service okay number one i have never given such a promise the promise i have given the promise listen the promise i have given scholarship scholarship is what i give and as we speak i have given i have given over over 500 scholarships to tertiary students. But when our chief All right? spoke, yes. But when our yes. chief spoke, so, so let me answer. He mentioned yes, so let me respond. That they have not benefited so, from any. So let me respond. I have served under two DCs between 2017 and 2021 January. DC Mallet, may God bless his soul. He's, he's, he died recently. So the scholarships I grant, I don't see no MPCs is common fund. No MP, you don't see the money. The money is approved by the DC. So when I get application or request for assistance, I approve, I indicate the amount, I give it to him to sign. Then, then the DC will sign. So between 2017 and now, the scholar, as I speak, I have prepared another list of over 100,000 to be given to students. He's aware. He has been approving it. And yet, he says that he doesn't know what I've used my money for. Second, youth unemployment. Because this is a rural district, I have decided that I cannot generate a factory. Because when the government says one district, one factory, I wasn't capable of influencing that. He is capable of influencing that. He hasn't done that. So what I'm capable of influencing with my common fund is what I'm telling you. I've, I've been able to procure Okada or Prakia lines. But you've seen the street. You've seen the street. Now, that is what the young people do. All right? That is what the young people do to sustain themselves. And they are, they've been running to problems with the police. So as an MP, what do you do? What do you do? What you do is that you intervene. One license costs 1,200. Peki alone, I have done 100. 100 for Okada and Pragya people. Saturday, just last Saturday, after the Young Festival, 
I gave out 65 licenses at the community center. Bafe got 200, Germany got 350. That is what I do. Now let's go to women. Women who are into seamstressing. I provide them with sewing machines, all coming from my common fund. So, so as for, you see, you see, so if you appreciate the dynamics of the district, there are some areas, because the roads are so bad, vehicles don't go. So it is the motor riders who go and transport the people and their goods and services. So as an MP, I must intervene. You understand? You are a person. You are giving him too much time. That, you spoke a that, lot that stops you spoke misconducting a lot. yourself. Huh? This is national TV. While you were talking, I was quiet. So you weren't quiet. I'm I was about quiet. Two minutes more. Yes. I'm about two minutes more. So the road, roads. When you speak of roads, Jaja won't use his part of the common fund to do anything. Every every road in this constituency, every year, I grade it. This year, this year, this year, this year. Let me tell you, this year, 1911 Park, 1911 Park, I graded it. 1911 Park Road, is just here, I graded it. Jaka, when Jaka wanted to celebrate the funeral of um, uh, Togu Jaha, no, the funeral is... Uh, the two minutes is up. Uh, I think that the two minutes oh, is up. The, from, so the Jaka, is up. hold on, Jaka to Anu, I graded it. Totombe to Germany, I graded it. Chinu Road, Sanga Chinu, I grade it. What has Jaja done? Jaja. Ah, what has he done? He's asking what you have done. Very good. And so many accusations have been leveled against the you. The projects I've done. Including. I've given some of the evidence to your production team in terms of video and pictures. Right. Is this the road that you graded? Honorable, is, it one, that is, is this so, one of that them? Is one. Which particular one is this one? This should be, this should be Totome to Germany Road. This one. Just this year. Just this year. Jaja. Jaja. I'm waiting for your response, please. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the MP, Honorable Dapia Mekpo. Stop addressing me. Said, Address your problems. Said they have given me. Fertilizers to be given to yes, him. Yes, and he says it and is in your house. Yeah, he 400 said, bags. Which is a total lie. The P Ministry for Food and Agriculture sent us fertilizers. They said I should give 300 bags to the MP. Myself, 300 bags. And some also to a Greek director okay. in charge of the district. When was this done? Uh, when, were, when were they giving to you? Three weeks ago. Okay. Yeah. But where and, are the fertilizers currently? And when my brother, when my brother was campaigning, started campaigning, he came to this very community telling the people that his fertilizer is with me and I refused to give it, give it to him. But where are the fertilizers? Let, let me tell you. When he heard that they have sent fertilizers and he's having document to that effect, as a learned lawyer, I expect him to come to me and say, Chief, I'm coming to take my fertilizer. But I ask the PM whether he has come to me. The fertilizers are there. But one thing I want him to tell the good people of South Dine is he received a lot of items from this very government. He, but he always keeps them. So I am expecting him to come, to approach me. He has never come to me to collect those fertilizers. So can sitting I here can I to tell lies. Can I correct that? No, not yet. Not no, yet. Let me correct no, not you. yet. No, no. It's not important. yet. Not yet. It's important. Not yet. It's important. No, so, not, I'll let so, one minute. So I'll let um, you have no, your one say. minute. Honorable, trust me. I'll let you have uh, your say. Let, let me come to the no. road. But before you move on, he, he, he has a response about the fertilizers. No, let me also go on. No, but you he allow has a him, response. You let allow him, him just respond to the fertilizers. Let him just respond to the okay. fertilizers. Honorable. Yes, the Ministry of Food and Agriculture wrote a separate letter to him, as they did see. And wrote a separate letter to me. Agree. That I should collect 300 bags of fertilizer. That's NPK. And 100 urea, 400. He will collect a similar quantity. When the fertilizers were delivered to the assembly, he ordered the director of Agri. I am supposed to see the director of Agri, not him. 
Ah, why should I come to you? So, so you are so, so who you ordered and took the who fertilizer received the to the house. Who received the item? Who are, is the recipient? Are you, are, you, the are you the procurement officer of the assembly? Who is the recipient? Are you, are you the procurement officer of the who assembly? Who is the recipient? It's, suppo it's supposed to be the procurement officer. Never. You are you are abusing who, your are, who is in charge well, of the He is the DCE, correct? Yes, he is the DCE. DCE. So but if he receives them, no, your he's, colleagues, no, he's your not colleagues, the procurement officer. Your colleagues, he's where are they the receiving them from? Wait. He's not the storekeeper. Okay, are your you the storekeeper? Wait. Your colleagues, if, where? If but what I we come, want to understand is this. If I come and the fertilizer oh. is missing, can I ask him? What we want to understand is this. Have you gone to him to ask if your fertilizers are with him the or not? The letter didn't say I should go to him. That's the lie he's telling. Okay, so who have you gone the to? Letter said, the letter said I should go to the district agric officer. Ah, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? You are abusing your office. You are abusing it's a your total office. Lie. Oh, who signed? So who signed you are not the storekeeper for Southern District Assembly. Who signed the you invoice? are not. You are not the procurement officer. So I'm telling you, if I come and my fertilizer portion is missing, I cannot ask you. Okay, but if it's so, not supposed to be with him, that, why are you accusing so him that he's doing it? He has that that is not supposed it is to be with him. You said it's not supposed yes. to be with him. It is in his house. If it's not supposed to be with him, then it is not his fault. It is in his house. It is in his where house. is my house? Yes. Where is my house? Your, your residence. This is residence. That's where it is. Okay. This man. Let's move uh, on. Uh, uh, my sister. Yes, sir. This is residency. It's a residence. Is it not official? It is official. Doesn't it belong to the assembly? So you are the, the, the quantity of fertilizers which we receive, there is no store uh, that Sadi. can accumulate Mila that Sadi. number of fertilizers. But, you but the question. But you do agree. The question. But, but, but do you agree? And do you have fertilizer? Two separate letters are written. You are no, 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 no. Is the is same your house letter, the storehouse? Is the is, same letter. This is your residence. This is your warehouse. In the letter. This is your warehouse. It is clearly stated. Your house is your warehouse. It is clearly stated. That nonsense. The MP. You are stupid. Yes. You are stupid. Yes. It's nonsense. You are stupid. It's nonsense. You are stupid. Yes. Sir. What you are saying is nonsense. Sir. Jaja. Your house is your Jaja. storehouse. Jaja. Is your house. Is your Jaja. storehouse. Jaja. Jaja. Ah. But after you let, received, let, after let, let you received, wait, 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 wait. Let, let me tell you. I want to, I want to ask you a question. He can't tell me he's stupid. It's a fish. No, 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 no. I said you are speaking nonsense. No, I spoke English. This, I said you are. We will stop it right here. What you are saying doesn't make sense. If you do not, it doesn't make sense. Speak in a civil manner. You are saying that the fertilizers are not with you. Honorable. Then second breath. Honorable. Honorable. The house. You are that is official. Jaja. That's resident. Jaja. After you, after you receive them, have you handed them over to procurement for distribution? The you handed them over to procurement. So yeah. it's with procurement at the exactly. moment. Exactly. Are you sure? You can go to the assembly and find out. Okay. All right. Honorable. He says it is not in his house and that it is with procurement. No, no. Let's move on from fertilizers. Can I, uh, can I say this? Uh, still about no, no, no. Yes. You are allowing him no, to man. The, okay. oh, no. the man just told you that no, 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 no. his residence no, no. is in our official. Yeah, no, that's what he, he said. said. Yes. His residence is in our official. Yes. So when when procured items come from Accra, because this is residence is official, is that where the storekeeper should go and receive the thing? But he says is it is with saying? procurement This guy now. is clueless. That's what he doesn't saying know what now, to speak about. That it is with procurement. Hello. Like Hello. Clueless. Hello. Jaja, move on. You said this. Uh, you said that. Move on. You said let's this. Move on. You said that. You are clueless. Jaja, let's make progress. Jaja, you are not worth for you, you are clueless. You are, you are a liar. Oh, you are, you are clueless. You are clueless. My sister. Yes, sir. Uh, is this is this for the fertilizer? No, 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 no. Okay. The fertilizers, you know, have been received by me. Okay. I signed the invoice. Okay. The instruction that they attach to the fertilizers is the DC must sign the invoice. Okay. I can show you the invoice. So you signed the invoice. Yes. And you handed it over to procurement. Exactly. exactly. So as we speak, and ask it's him in the whether, procurement office. Yes. Ask him whether he has even come. Have you to been able to distribute your three hundred though? We have started distribution. When did you start? We have started three weeks now. We received the You've been three distributing three weeks now. Yeah. So some of the farmers in this constituency can attest to the fact that yeah. they've received some. You have. Yeah. 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 Uh, my dear sister. But the question I want to ask. Yeah. 
The MP is also a member of the constituency. And a member of the family. Thank you very much. A letter was written to him as well. So if he hasn't written come to you, to me and copy thank was you. given to him. So he, so you are brothers in the constituency. Yeah. So I'm just asking, if he hasn't come to you yet, was there anything wrong? Why you also couldn't contact him? You are funny. You asked a very nice question. Mm. Where you are funny. When he started campaigning, he hasn't come to me. But in this same community, Roxin told chief and people of this community that they have given him fertilizers which I am refusing to give him. And the people called me. Then I said, why? Roxin hasn't come to me for fertilizers and I refuse to give him. Why then is he using this to campaign? So after you heard that, why didn't you also come back to him that I'm Never. hearing... I won't give him no, that no, no, respect. No. no way, why not? He's not a bad me. Community. I can't give him that respect. I can't give him that distance. You cannot come down to yes. his level. Yes. You cannot come because, down to his because level. Because of the way he's behaving. But that because. is the MP of the constituency. And I'm also the DC. So if we are going to do DC, MP, DC, MP, where are we headed? Is this a power struggle between the two it's of you? It's not a power struggle at all. So then the farmers in the constituency should suffer. They the fertilizers must it. sit in one place. Only his own. It's there. And you are happy about it as the he DCE. Has, he hasn't come to me. No, but you are the DCE. So it means that the welfare of the farmers must be of, 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 of high cons concern to you. So if they are not receiving it, why are you not alerting him to come pick it up so it can be distributed he to the farmers? He has not come to take them. I even asked him on one occasion that, Roxin, you said I received fertilizers. Yes. How can't you come to me and you'll be actually telling people that your fertilizers are with me and a single bag will not remain with me. He hasn't come to me. He's there. And you because, don't... because he has been condemning MPP government, the president, all the time. He cannot actually come and to me. And you don't and think say, this back and forth, MPDC, MPDC, is actually stalling government's plan of planting for food let, and let, jobs? Let me show you. Show me. Let, let me show you something. Because this thing is, is of let, great let, concern to let, me. Let me show you something. Show me, sir. The most corrupt. One second. The most corrupt MP we ever had in South Dine is Dapia Mekpo. Look. Hello. Before. Are Hello? you also taking a jab at him because he took no, a no, jab no, no, at no. you? I want to prove this to yeah, you. Prove, prove it. Yeah. What evidence is this? There is the law says before you procure item mm. for the constituent in the district, mm. it must pass through tender process okay. or procurement process. Okay. Look, this is what Honorable Dapia Mekpa wrote to me. Five, fifteen bundle of hot of roofing sheet. Yes. This is another one, 35, 35 bundles. Bundles of roofing sheets. Now, he, he, he claimed, he claimed he bought those roofing sheets with that tendering process, distributing them. He distributed them already. The item have not even passed through store. And he brought this thing before me to approve. And you and signed? You, I'm not the one who signed. He's the coordinating director. I have not signed. Did you? And he expect this, expect me to sign this thing for him. If MP procure items with the taxpayers' money, with MP common fund, is it not to pass? Is it the, the law doesn't it says that the item are passed through stores? He distributed these things already. Now that he brought this letter, how will I know? He has that distributed he, already. He claimed yes, which we. Another document. Listen. Yes, you can. These are okay. some kilometers of road that can he I, wrote to respond? me that he wanted to... Okay, so before the roads, he wants to respond to this one. No, no, no. Let's tell him the, the, the roofing sheets. Sheet. Let him respond Daja, to the roofing sheets. Comport yourself. Comport yourself. Honorable, Daja, hold what's on. your response yes, to the roofing sheets? My sheet? response is that Act Procurement Act, Act 663, as amended by Act 914, gives me the power to procure under emergency. You see, it is so sad. And the that, that, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, can you keep quiet? Can you keep quiet? quiet? Ah, Let's, be quiet. Let's behave ourselves. It is so sad that a DCE, 
a DC who says, Ekbin vi kpankpa, Peki vi kpankpa, no da konayi. When there was a, a rainstorm, that ripped off roofing, uh, roofs of buildings in Chame and Wudome. And the people are in distress. Emergency situation. You are saying that I should call you and procure before I give roofing seats to people in Chame and Wudome. Don't you know? Wait, so can, don't can you, you know? How can he account? Oh, you are not a lawyer, so keep quiet. Don't you know that, know that under emergency you, situations, you can rectify that? And, but, but you are so clueless, you are so naive. When, when, it, when rain, rainstorm, sure roofs in Peking, oh, this is a DC who says that it's from Peking. Peking people are in distress. You are I have assisted the them. Yeah. You are, you are, no, no, you are, no, no. You are a plane. You are using it to Look at this people. man. Look at this man. They called him. They called him. He's chicken out. No, 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 no. He, you went to hiding. That is why I gave the roofing sheet out. You were using. You went into hush, hiding. This is. They hush, were hush, calling you. You hush, went into hush, hiding. Hush, hush, the, the unit board, committee. The, the unit committee. Woodome and Chame. Okay. They are here. They are here. They All can right. Attest to this. So we want to come back. Hush, hush, go and ask Tobey Baduvia. Go and ask Tobey Baduvia. You can ask him. Okay. But the only way we can verify is to come back to the community and know if all these things that the two of them are saying are correct or not. Community members, we would like to hear from you. Anyone to come to the microphone? Anyone? No, you've spoken already. Anyone to come to the microphone? I need those who have benefited from the fertilizer. I need also those who benefited from the roofing sheets. When the rainstorm hits the, the community, the fertilizer is still ongoing. No problem at all, sir. We are not doubting you. We are not doubting you. Sir, you want to speak? Please come to the microphone. Oh, there's someone there already. Let's hear you. Hello. We can hear you. Yeah. Uh, hello. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead, sir. Yeah. Uh, Unkonyanya justice, I'm powerful. Madam Kuku, moderator, I am very sorry to say this. In that, the way the moderation went, I am actually not happy. What are you not happy about? Yeah, uh, we are here to tell the electorate, or for some questions to be asked for better clearance right but you sat there and honorable Dapia Mekpo, my very good friend went about insulting the personal attacks over here mm. i don't want to believe it's a part of, of uh, let me, let did me you hear my response when he said uh, that? Uh, Were uh, you seriously, listening? Uh, seriously, uh, so don't question my moderation. If you uh, did not hear me, uh, then I, don't I, question I, I it. Was right here. Look behind you. Someone is you. talking to you. If you did not can hear we, me, can we continue? Then can yes, we continue? exactly. But do can not do not question my but moderation. It will, it will be very nice. Let's go on, yeah, sir. Let's get to the core of the issue, beautiful. sir. Uh, my friends. My friends, we can hear you. We can okay. hear you. My friends made some contradictory uh, statements. When you say here. friends, who? Oh, they are, oh, we are not enemies. Uh, no, I want to know. Like from, I, I'm from, talking about those who. Okay, uh, I thought you were talking about yes. the PCs. Oh, no. Okay, all right. They made some contradictory statements. Which are what and what? One, they did mention that when Jaja came, uh, Honorable Dajawa uh, came to office, they've seen nothing about him okay as the dc okay and contradicting themselves even the dc uh, the mp himself did mention that the main person in charge of development in this constituency is, is the, the DC. dc yes which i never mentioned that alluded to. You, somebody mentioned it you did I say it i never mentioned you agreed it. to it let's somebody go on you agreed to let's it let's go on so no, you agree to it in my mouth it was this gentleman who stated it it was this gentleman who stated it you agree to it let's go on jaja 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 please let's go on yeah so having listened to our queen mother and the chiefs they did mention that we don't have any project going on 
our wards do not have scholarship. Having completed senior high school, they are unable to get scholarships to further their education. But, but my honorable MP answering them mentioned that he gave 500 scholarships to electorates of his constituency. Does it mean he did these things without the knowledge of my queen mother and my chiefs? It should tell you that the honorable MP is throwing dust into our eyes. Because there are a lot of electorates out here who are looking for money to further their education. But where is the funds? It is good the Akufado government brought this free SHS, but it is also bent on the MP, just as others are doing. I can mention Honorable the Majority Leader in Parliament, Honorable uh, Okujato Abrakwa, and others. We see it, we feel it, but our MP is not doing such. One thing I know for sure always blaming is this that project. he has always been discriminatory. He has always been discriminatory. The Peki Valley is not of concern to him. Peki Valley is not of concern to him. He mainly does his things around Tongo, Germany area. Which he cannot run away from. He knows what I'm saying is a fact. And it is not right as an MP to be discriminatory um, among your uh, uh, electorates. What is he doing? We want him to point out something. All right, no problem. Other people have to speak yeah. as well. Thank you so, so, so we very well received. Thank you. Um, another, is it a question or a comment? No, I want to clarify. Okay, you want to clarify? Yes. Which one, please? About the no, 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 I want to know. Because About the I don't want to create sheets. any confusion here. Iron sheets. About the iron sheets? Yes. What do you want to clarify, please? All right. So I have the number of people who received the iron sheet at Chame. Who are you, sir? You haven't mentioned your name. Okay, my you name are. is Adolf Taku. Okay. I am the unit committee chair. Unit committee yes, chair. Yes, yes. Okay. So... On that faithful day, I was there. Okay. I received the iron sheet, including how, the... How, how many of them? Give me some time. Yes, sir. Including the chief. We received over 300 iron sheets. As counting one to 300 of the iron sheets. So that's what I want to clarify. I have the number of people who have received the iron sheets. Yes, I'm listening. Yes. I'm listening, I'm listening. So, so we have over 30 people who received that iron sheet. Now you have changed it from 300 no, to 30. No, the number of the people who received the iron sheet. The number of people who received the iron sheet. Wait, wait. Yeah. We want to understand. Okay. No, Honorable, I'm asking because the letter here says 35 bundles. Yes. 35 bundles. And there was 15 as well. So please don't confuse us. That's no. why I want to understand. Yes. If it was 300 bundles? No, no, or... no not 300 bundles. Okay. Not 300. About, about 300 counting. Not okay, pieces. in singles. Pieces. Yes, If pieces. you're counting in singles. Yes, pieces. There was a chief with you that day. Y yes, Which yes. Which chief was it, Talk please? Baduvier, okay. The fourth. So he received it on behalf of the people. Yes. And you can attest to the fact that you received over 300 of course, single yes. sheets of, course, yes. of iron sheets. Of course, yes. Okay. Hello, hello. Now, hello. Now, now can I? Hello. Wait, wait. No, don't go, don't go. Say, hello, don't go. Please bring back the image. Bring back the image of the iron sheets. I okay. want him yes, to verify... Yes, yes. What, was this that day? Is this what's on the screen? That was that, that day? Yes, that's it. That's Do you it. have so, a photo of you and the chief receiving the items? Okay, so that's you at yes, the back. Yes, yes, yes. Hello. All right. Okay. 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 But what I am seeing there... I don't think it's up to 300, though. We, we, uh, cookie I don't tea. think cookie the tea. number of cookie sheets tea. over... Yes, the sir. fact of the issue is that uh -huh. 
we receive this iron sheet in two folds. In two folds. That, listen, listen. We receive it in two folds. We shared the first one, and the second trend came, and we shared it again. The rest is there. The rest of the iron sheet. Yes, sheets yes, are yes. It's there. It's there. It's there. Wow. Uh, if can you I, like, can I, if you can like, I yes. Hello. Hold now, on a second. Now, hold on, hold on. Now, that there is was for, a question here. Now, that is. There was a question that, here. That is for only Chame. There was a question there was here. Hello. There was Tomba. Hello. There was Tomba. Hello. 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 The question I asked about this. Yes. Can you, can I, you, can I, you I, keep I, quiet? I, 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 this I want can you to keep no, quiet? No, no, no. Can you keep quiet? Honorable, honorable. I am not saying. Let's be civil. No, no, no. Let's be civil. Honorable. Yes. Let's be civil. No, no, no. Honorable, please hold on. Let's be civil. Can you just conclude on this so that you yes. answer the question that the gentleman asked, please? I, I am not saying that he has not bought iron sheet packing and, and they say and they say pick up and distribute it to people. I am saying that the 50 bundle of roofing sheet did it go through procurement? No, 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 no. Storekeeper, it must pass through store. Storekeeper must take inventory because we are accountable to the people. This 50 bundle that he claimed he has purchased. You cannot verify exactly. that, that it I'm was 35 bundles that, exactly. plus an additional 15, 15 because 15, it didn't 15 go bundles. through stores. Uh, yes, exactly. Okay. That's what I'm telling him. Okay. Later on, he'll write to me right now that I should give him 1 million Ghana City. For the 35 and the extra 15. 15. Yes, that's what he has been doing. That's why I said he's the most corrupt. This, uh, One million Ghana cities. Later on, for the 50 bundles. I can't. Later, for the 50 bundles I of rupees. I am telling you. Honorable. That Honorable. That's what he will do. Did you ask him for uh, a million uh, Ghana cities? Uh, 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 for 50 uh, uh, sheets? Uh, 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 I, have, I have told you that my friend, the DC has no credibility. I've told you that. Second, it's so your I word am, against his no, now. I am exposing or him. His against ah, yours. He said I have asked for one million for the 15 bundles. You yes. should, should bring the evidence. Later on. Uh, later on. Ah, I will ask for Verbally one million. Verbally or in writing. Ah, okay. Was it verbal so, or so, in writing? So I haven't asked yet. So I haven't asked for it yet. No, he said later you see, on you cookie, asked. Cookie, yes, sir. you know what is sad? In this community, in, in the Peki Valley, there was a heavy rainstorm. So the rainstorm happened around this time of the day. Then they break, roofs are off. How long and the have people you kept, are in distress. How long have you kept those so, sheets? So, later on so, so when I came to visit the victims, I had to do something. I couldn't, I couldn't provide roofing sheets to cover every household. But because there were many, I needed to intervene. Okay. I did the intervention in Wudome, Chambe, Tongo and Tongo Kaira. That is where the rainstorm he happened. Kept those things in you his understand? Own house so, for if so the DC, for so, so many men, DC, can you comport yourself? You have spoken. Okay. If DC thinks that there's something wrong with the procurement, ah, call the auditors. Are you an auditor? DC, are you an auditor? Are you, are you, are you, are you an auditor? Are you, are you, are you an auditor? All the time. Are you, are just all the, all the are you an auditor? Are you an auditor? That is what I'm saying. This uh, DC yes. is clueless. He doesn't. He just talks. Okay. Are you an auditor? Uh, are you an auditor? That is why I refuse. Uh, are you an auditor? That is why I refuse. My duty. Approve this. My duty okay. is to give references All right. to the victims in Wudome, Chame, Ahong, Afghanistan. There's another if constituent. You pay, that is your problem. Young lady, young lady, please come to the microphone. Young lady, no, no, sir. Yeah, I'm, I'm speaking. Let me speak. Okay. Uh, uh, Madam Kukunami. Hey, any new planning? My any agenda? What plan are you going? Ghana Police. Madam Kukunami. No matter my apartment revenue, I'm going to be my value. At the Mount Ejirami. Honorable. Abu, you are chale. Open this street, man. At the choice in your van, no katutu or one up with you. I was part born the film about eight to four eight years now. Part film I've ever found. Look at Joe. Maria Kukulo. Yo, my. Is this is this addressed to the DC? No, no, no. I'm asking. No, no, no. I'm asking my honourable. But he is not the agent for development. Ah. 
So wait, I will not wait, ask you a question. Wait, I'm from wait. the area. No, I need. I can never talk. Wait, I can wait, no. wait, I can wait, never talk. I can wait. never talk about the area. Wait. The where I came from. Unless, Abi was the place course, where I came from. Please hold so on. So I have to talk and ask question about that. Okay. I get it. But I want Hello. I want to understand why. Jaja, Bajiraila. Oh no, my sister. Away at DC. Saying that. No, no, Bajiraila. He's not an agent he's not. for development. He's not. He's a total lie. He's not. He's a total lie. He is not. I am on. National television. He is not, not my MP darling. is an agent Sir, finish for with, development. Finish with your questions, So please. I'm asking my honorable MP. Please hold on. Ah, uh, Bade. Bade Kukune. I show me. Can you cut to Tukyo or one up with Tau? Okay. Evelia, ever what pipe? Name me eight years Was it rainfall or low spillage? Which one was it? The spillage. The spillage. Yes, it's affected this. But let me go locally. Okay. But I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back. Okay. Yo, look at your one enemy. I'm going to go back. About eight years here now. Etiamala Dodo. Yo, let me go. Eight years. Etiamala Dodo. Etiamala Dodo. Etiamala Dodo. Etiamala Dodo. Okay. Yeah. Yo, people like that. I'm the premise this in there. I'm from Vire Chong. Since 1992. I want that. I want that. I want that. I want that. Premise never be born. Because in 2023, I came upon a bovala. We received about 300 drums of petrol free free well. I am not deceiving you. Aya is the true matter. Aya Bromele. Aya Nya Ika. Nya Pecho. Nya Fadi Sibole. Abri. I'm talking about Abri community. I am not talking about any place. Honorable. Yeah, Aita Nya Nya Mita. Mabi Nya Nya Fadi Sibole. I want to give you the opportunity to answer the questions. I want to give you the opportunity to answer the questions. Do you want to answer the questions? Do you want to answer the questions? Then I'll give you the opportunity. Aha, so that's why I'm asking that. Do you want him to answer? I want to be fair. I'm not here to support any candidate. Who am I supporting? Okay. I'm only doing my work. I am only doing my work. If you want us to close right now, we'll close because I didn't come to support anyone. I came to support Pecky. I came to support South Dying. That's what I came to do. Okay. So if you want to answer the question, please answer. Otherwise, the question was directed to him. Okay, Allow him to answer. Okay. Uh, uh, cook it. Thank you very much. Obiba, when I became MP, I brought NGO from Japan to build a basic school in Abui. Yes. You know, yes no? the same NGO built a nine-unit classroom block in Abui. You know, yes. Honorable Asima had started uh, a six-unit classroom one? block. I finished it. You know, yes. all in Abui. Honorable, he's asking about water. Hold on. That has not flown for eight years. I am getting there. 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 What do you call Adam? What do you call our former Adam? Adam. He started from his side. Allow him to answer. Please allow him to answer your questions. Allow him. Answer the questions. Allow him. Allow him to answer your questions. Oh yeah. Please go ahead. Thank you very much. The water project that he speaks of, it was a project I lobbied from Koda, Coastal Development Authority. Then it was under government special initiative. Again, your man, he wasn't even in office. It was under this email. Is that it on the screen? No. This, no. Uh, this is no. Safe water. That is a borehole. So Koda was supposed to have completed the project, mechanized it. And operationalize it. They put a pump in the project. There's a pump underground. But the person who is the engineer who is supposed to operationalize it hasn't been paid. There's one as I speak to you at Pekin. Ah, Coastal Development Authority. Yes, it's a, it's a government agency. I went to lobby for the project. As an MP, I don't use my pocket money to go and fund those projects. So finally, finally. If, if you, you, if oh, you have loved it, can you comport yourself, Obiba? Uh, yeah, I can know. you comport yourself? You, yeah, if you have can you comport project, yourself? Sir, and the project sir, is not Can you can comport you yourself? Allow, you if ask you your question, you sir. Yourself? And the project is not Madam, ah, you come to the microphone. Can you comport yourself? Madam, sir, I, Honorable, are you done answering? No, I'm not done. Because he, he wants spoke, to come in. He spoke about spillage. You heard, you heard him that. Can, can somebody. Sir, sir, do you want your questions answered or not? Can you allow him to answer? So allow him to answer. Allow him. Now, now the Coastal Development Authority are written to them for them to come and finalize the project. That is what an MP is supposed to do. Now let's 
let's go, let's go to the, the water issue. You heard him say that in, in Abui, they were victims of the flooding. Yes. You heard him say that. Yes. And yet we are saying that somebody says that they were not affected by flooding. Now, the point, the point is that Abui will benefit. Their benefit is on the way. It's, it, the, the, the time hasn't elapsed. So Abui will benefit. Every single community has benefited except Abui. The last one I sent went to Chita, which is next door. So Obiba, don't worry. Abui's consignment will come when I get it from the NGOs. Jaja, do you want to say anything before I go to the next question? Can I go to her? Enyoa, my year. Davi. Speak into the microphone, please. Virginia, dear John Gau. Medakuku, Broko, one who could not be there. I bet MP. Fifula, who can you make for Benen of Bobo? I mean, you're You want UK. You want UK. You want UK. May you do a guy. No, you guy, you did. She ain't what Gawo. Many about no personal attacks or not. Many are Jimmy Law. Evelia. Evelia, what has he done? He should tell us what he has done. Which document? Prove it to us. Because, so can you please tell them to go? Listen to what I'm saying. You listen. 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 Then please, I beg you. Yes, madam. Yes, madam. Please, what I'm saying is that I, I know the main purpose of this gathering is for the two people and okay, the incoming to tell us what he would like to do. That's why he wants to go. And therefore. <laughs> should tell us what he has done in eight years and not personal attack and what he will be doing that is what we want to know my second question please can i continue can i continue in my mp submission go ahead go ahead All right, we cannot seem to hear you. Speak again and let me see. Is your microphone working? Please pass it to her for me. Please pass the microphone to her for me. Vaho. Finish this right here. Thank you. My second question too is that my MP did mention in submission that he has given handwrite scholarship to people in jacket. Uh, he said he, he gave over 500 yeah. by 100 to Jacket community. Okay. In his introduction, he did mention some of uh, some towns in South Dan yes. as uh, part of his constituent. So giving to Jacket 100 uh, slots, how many has he given to the rest? Or is Jacket alone the, uh, the, okay. the South of Coast, uh, the okay. South Dan Coast? Yes. Okay. Thank you. All right, no problem. Jaja, so she wants to know. And it's one of the questions I was going to ask before we finally say goodbye to Pe Pekia Vetile. She's asking that as you are vying to become the MP of this area, what exactly is the roadmap for this constituency? You want to ask both of them, so I'm asking him and I'll come to him. What's the roadmap? Thank you very much. Before I answer you, uh, I thank the Almighty God that rocks in today testify that the Astro Tef that I'm building at Peke Jacket is not the type or the one that the president promised to build at uh, Peke Chami. He said it. That I went and lobbied. I, I never said that. He, he said it. I never said Honorable. so. Honorable. You Honorable. said. Honorable. You Honorable. No, 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 no. Honorable. Let him and finish. And I'm saying that if I were the president, I'll sack you. I'll fire you. No, no, no. Honorable. You shouldn't Honorable. put words in my mouth. Honorable. I never said so. Let him finish. Let him finish, please. Continue. Jaja, continue. Continue. Jaja, continue. Uh, no, Honorable. No. Honorable, give me your microphone. Thank uh, you. Uh, Let's uh, go. Uh, and he went ahead to let the good people of Savdine to know that 
the one the president promised. The size you have been bigger than the one that I'm building at Peke Jake. Once again, I am telling him that he should go back to the president, do his, his homework, plead, plead with him to come back to Chami and build the one that he promised people of Chami. Okay. Now, She's still waiting. She's now, still waiting. She wants to know what the roadmap now, is. Yeah. At the initial stage, we all know that unemployment, especially among the youth, is the major challenge okay. that we are facing in South Dine. Roxen has been MP for eight good years. You know, he has not been able to actually take any measure, any step to address this challenge. We have infrastructure deficit in the district, which I am trying to address. So I am unveiling myself for this position that Inshallah, by God's grace, when I unseat him, I will help the people of Sabdai to address the youth unemployment challenge in Sabdai. And I will ensure that the standard of living of the good people of Sabdai will be improved. Already, the central government, my government, is taking a whole lot of social intervention program in the district. Only last week, we trained about 50 youth in aquaculture for food and job. 50 youth. And at the same time, we are actually providing chickens or chicks to people, a whole lot of farmers, poultry farmers, to, you know, make a livelihood. So my vision is, I would like to address the unemployment challenge which the people are facing, which Roxin refused to face, to, to, to solve. Already, someone said he is actually creating division in the district. Formerly, when Onabu Asima was MPP, was, was MP, we, we, we don't know the difference between Bali, Tongo, Germany people, and Peke people. But today, He's campaigning that Tongo people should vote against Peke people because I am from Peke. Me? So this man sitting here, he is, he is creating division in the district. And I'm coming on board to unite all the four traditional areas in the district. Thank you. All right. Honorable, this is your microphone. Yet, uh, Honorable, tell us what the roadmap is. We are wrapping up in five minutes. No, five but minutes you know, is not enough. I mean, I mean, Avertile, so let me start from Avertile. This market, the concrete there they are standing on, I did it. I, me, I did it. I did it. Me, I did it. Number two, number two, there's a land litigation community here, and, and there's a committee that champions that. It's called a parliament, land litigation. As MP, I support with 10,000 Ghana cities, 100 million. I support them. As the MP, as the MP, I support youth in this community. There's a science project in this community called Yamuranza Science Project. But, but for my lobbying skills, the project wouldn't have come. And every year, every year, I support students and assist them to go to Accra and participate in this fair. It is located in this community. When I came, when I became MP, this community, this community, there was no health facility. Today, there's a health center here that they have approached me to assist them with equipment, hospital beds, and all that through my intervention. In this community, they started, they started to do their own community engagement, which is to lead to community self-help projects. They are, they are constructing their own gutters along the community roads. I've come to assist them when they did the fundraising. He was there as well. In this community, in this community, there's a school called Avertile Methodist. I came to support them to undertake the school project. They did it. In this community, I've supported LA Primary with roofing sheets and cement 
and they know. I in know. So let's go to the roadmap. What's the plan? Now the roadmap is that rock for three. Rocks in us. The former cup for three. I'm going for the third term. Yeah. And when I when yeah. I when I engage the the people and I show them that when when His Excellency John Damani Mahama, when he wins in December 7, 2024, myself and him will undertake more projects. And again in Avertile, the Avertile police station that you see, I completed it with the pursuit of my MP's common fund. He was not even a, 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 a DC. I completed it. And let me, I'm not done. When you go to Gov, Govco, Peking Training College, which is now College of Education, the, the four-story four guest hostel was started by us and the NDC. I came to lobby for payment from Get Fund. It's been completed. But honorable. Hold on, let me finish. Honorable. Hold on, let me yes, finish. Honorable. Let me finish. Let's go back to Govco again. Govco. The Gulf Coast streets and roads within the school. I lobbied first guy. Honorable, I brought first I guy here. We were on the road Look, now. the pictures are there. I brought Honorable, first guy. I thought we were on the road now. What's the plan? What's the plan moving forward? Honorable, what's the plan moving forward? Plan moving forward? We want the to plan, know. Just get to the plan yes. for us. The way forward is that. The way forward is that development is is not proceeding or progressing at the rate at which we desire. Because the MP, he has, he has put it out that the MP, me, from 2017 to 2023, I got 3 million Ghana cities. Granted, this is the funds that came to the assembly from 20, 2027. 2027. 2017 or 2027? 20, 20, 2017. Uh, this is the assembly's common fund. They got 3.1 million. IGF. They got 335,000. 2018, uh, common fund, they got 4.2 million. IGF, the assembly got 518,000. 2019, common fund, 5.1 million. Uh, IGF, 493,000. If we have it, so, let's project it, please. It's here. If it's we here. have it, it let's is, project it. It is sourced from the Auditor General's report. Uh, but honorable, from 2017. all these are not talking or addressing Hold the on. issue of because, the roadmap. Because, because he as the president's representative in the district who is supposed to champion developmental projects, he can't do it. Now, he wants to come and do MP's work with 3 million. You got Chaja, you got 44 million. You couldn't utilize it. You want to utilize 3 million Honorable, uh, yes. thank you very much. Yes. Honorable, the, the, thank you. The assembly. I wanted you to tell us what the roadmap is, but unfortunately, the no, roadmap is no, the not road, coming. No, the, the roadmap is what I'm telling you is that. But you've exhausted your five minutes, when, sir. As the MP, if I get my president Jada. in Accra, pro progress of projects will be faster than it is Jada. now. That's the roadmap. Jada. I need to ask you this important question before we go. Put them, put you used to be there. very good friends they with Honorable Dafia Mekbo. You have been the DCE. Now, by you the grace of God, you want to become million. the MP. That's what, that's Tell us got. why you want to become MP contesting your own friend. Project it. Project Hello. It. You, said, you said he was my very good friend. Yes. I am not your uh, friend. Yeah. I am not. He was. When the time came for filing, and I decided to file on the ticket of MPP, yeah. he sent his close ally who is called a ball to me that they are pleading with me I shouldn't file on the ticket of MPP. The question I asked. Uh, I am coming uh, to the uh, question. Cookie, cookie. I shouldn't file. I'll right give there. you the opportunity. A boy is here. I just want to know why. Yeah. Having been the DCE for four years. Now for, for three years. For three for years. For three years. You are yeah. your Three, okay, for three years. Yeah. Now you want to become MP. Is there a reason? Yeah. What's the reason? Yeah. What's There's the reason? reason? What's the reason? Yeah. As the earlier said, as Roxin earlier said, I approve all his fund for him. Looking at the way he he is managing our funds, I realize that he is doing a great disservice to the people of South Dine. Since our Zoom office at DC, 
all the audit infraction that the external auditors have detected is as a result of his dealings. So I realize that he is not a good manager of our fund. Okay. So that's the main reason why I come All right. on board or unveil myself okay. to unseat him. All right. Thank you Besides very much. Besides that, he's not even happy. We are the done. People. We are done. Thank you so much, everyone, for your participation today. Here's where we'll draw the cancers down for our community manifesto from the South Dying constituency. Mama Kletogbio Akbenami Apete, thank you to all the community members. God bless all of you. Honorable, I wanted you to give us the roadmap. We waited and waited and it wasn't coming. He's giving us his last words. Unless, of course, you have your last words. Unless, of course. Yes, I am happy that he said he approves of all my fans. It the Queen every Mother sing, wants to address every us. Every single fans that I've applied, he has approved of it. If he thinks there's anything wrong with it, from 2017 to 2023, he should conduct I have an never, me, my I use of my fans has never featured in the Auditor General's report. But he has featured. He has appeared before me, before the Public Accounts Committee. You with are becoming. You are becoming. No, you are becoming. The Queen Mother you must You are becoming. You are corrupt. You are being the Can Auditor General's report. Can he pass the microphone to the Queen Mother? Me. You, you, you are becoming. You are becoming. You are corrupt. You, Jaja. Shall we please? Please. Let our Queen Mother have the last say. Let our Queen Mother have the last say before we go. Let our Queen Mother have the last say before we go, please. Hello. Mama girl, we are all ears. I thank you all for coming. And I thank God that everything went on successfully. And I pray all that they say would come to pass in Jesus' name. Thank you all. TV3, thank you. Thank you all the audience. May God send you back safe to your destinations.